Hi, welcome to Demon Center. I'm Hunter Wynn, as always, and we got two special guests here, Nick Lopez and Haystack Jorge Ozuna. Now we're going to take you through the first week, uh, first round of playoffs, which is against Tempe High School. Roll the clip. You rolling it? All right, we're going to start this first playoff with the inside tracks. And the quarterback rolls back. He's looking for a receiver. Where'd the ball go? Oh, and Schubert has it. He's running down the side. He's going towards the middle, and he does a flip in the end zone. And that probably wasn't the smartest thing Sadge did because number one, he's going to get chewed out by Coach Brown. Number two, penalty. Anyway, on the Demons' next drive, Harper's going to fake the punt and throws it to none other quarterback, Greg Walton. Coach Brown's got some tricks up his sleeves. Demons' next drive, quarterback Greg Walton rolls out, fakes it. And then he throws it right to Ronnie Sellers, sheds a tackler, running down by the 10 yard line, cuts back through, and is brought down the 1 yard line, and sets up Chase Harper for the touchdown. Not only can Harper pass and punt the ball, he can run it. He runs about from the 25 yard line all the way down to the 50 for the first down. Next play, Greg Walton will take the snap, and the little shovel pass to Corbin Jones. And he's going to go all the way with this one, a cloud of dust for six. And that makes the gap a little bit bigger for the Tempe Buffaloes. Now with the Buffaloes threatening to score, Chase Harpole and Corbin Jones stop him for a goal line stand. Man in motion, Walton will hand the ball off to Marshall Galbraith. And he looks for all the gaps. And no one's going to stop him as he takes the ball all the way in for the touchdown. This brings the Greenway Demons closer to the state playoff championship. All right, we're back in the studio. Now, uh, Queen Creek has a record of seven and three. They beat Arcadia and Higley. They've been some uh, pretty decent teams. Now, uh, Nick, can you tell me uh, some uh, offensive breakdown of uh, Queen Creek? Well, they probably have a healthy diet because they got a balanced team, all right? They got two quarterbacks with 500 yards both each, like passing yards. I, I can't even do that on Madden. I don't think Brett Favre can even do that on Madden. He can do it. And uh, I got 900 rushing yards for their running back, so he's going to be all over and down the field. Sideline to sideline player. Tell you that much. What, anything to say to that? Yeah, on the flip side, they only have one receiver over 600 yards. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> That's nothing. Us? Three legit players over 600 receiving yards. Not one, no. no. Two? <laughs> oh, three. 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 We got like triplets. Okay. <laughs> three receivers over 600 yards. Yeah. And now let's talk defense. Number 37, look out for him. 91 tackles during the regular season. That's something. Ooh. Watch out. Number 32, 87 wrap-ups during the regular season. That's a lot of ice bags for the Oof, season, I tell man. you that much. Oof. Get that guy a hospital bill, I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, the keys to the game for the de uh, Demons, we're going to have to stop the running game. And uh, on uh, offensive-wise, I think we need to uh, pick up the passing game more. And stay fresh. They got two quarterbacks with 500 passing yards. You know they're going to be running, too, if they're a running team. Yeah. they. So we got to stay fresh. Well, uh... Ladies and gentlemen, come out to tonight's game. It's at 7 o'clock. It is at Queen Creek, in fact. Second round of the playoffs. Let's see what your demons can do. See if they can upset Queen Creek. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, don't stop believing. Don't stop believing. Yeah. Don't know this one's And we're out of here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <I'm not> <laughs>